Have you ever found it difficult accessing certain parts of an app or screen while using it? If you have, then don't worry. In this video, I will show you a free mouse toggle app that allows you to access every part of any screen or app. Let's go and check it out. It's really important to protect your sensitive information while using the internet. The good news is that NordVPN can help keep your data safe and secure. Plus, Nord is more than just a VPN, with added benefits such as freeing you from any streaming restrictions. Don't miss out on the best VPN deal available right now. Check out the links provided in the description to get started and stay protected. When I review streaming devices, I use an application called Geekbench to run performance tests. However, when I try to use this application on an on-streaming device, I run into a problem. I have no way to navigate the screen, and as a result, I can't click the Run CPU Benchmark button. However, we can resolve the issue of inaccessible parts of the screen by installing a virtual mouse called MATVT. After installation and activation, a mouse pointer will appear on the screen, which will enable you to navigate and select those inaccessible parts. This app is compatible with any app that requires a mouse toggle. Installing and setting up MATVT is easy following these steps. All you need is the downloader app installed, which you can get from the Google Play Store. Open downloader and type 28907 into the search bar. Then click go and give the page a few seconds to load. Next, tap down the screen to view a list of categories. Select the Tools category, then tap down the list to find MATVT and select it. On the next screen, tap down until you see the blue download buttons that look like this. Then follow the on-screen prompt to install the app. If you get a pop-up message requesting permission to install unknown apps, select Settings and toggle on the Downloader option. Once enabled, you can continue with the installation process. When the app is installed, make sure to click Done and then Delete and Delete again to delete the installation file as it's no longer required and will take up space on your on-streaming device. Before we can open and use the mouse toggle app, there are a few more steps we need to complete first to make sure it works properly. First, we need to grant the application permissions to draw over apps. This will allow the mouse toggle to appear over the top of other open applications and allow you to navigate around them. From your home screen, go to Settings, select Apps, then tap down and select Special App Access. Select Display Over Other Apps, then scroll through this list and find MATVT. Click to select it and this will change the permissions to allow the MATVT app to display over the top of other apps. Next, we need to go into accessibility settings to turn on the mouse toggle service. Go back to your home screen and select settings again. Tap down and select System, then Accessibility. If you can't find accessibility, it may be under Device Preferences. Tap down and select Mouse Toggle Service. If you can't see Mouse Toggle Service, you may see Mouse Event Listening Service instead. Click to select it and click OK to enable it. 
Now that you have mouse toggle installed, you can use it in any app. To activate it, press and hold the mute button on your remote control for two seconds. You will now see that the mouse mode has been activated and a mouse pointer appears in the center of your screen. You can use the D-pad on your remote to move the mouse pointer up, down, left and right. This will allow you to select areas of the screen that were previously inaccessible. If you want to use the mouse toggle to be able to scroll up and down the screen like this, so you can scroll through lists or move up and down pages, with the mouse toggle enabled, press the mute button on your remote and this will put the mouse into scroll mode. Press once on the mute button again to disable the scroll feature and go back to mouse mode. When you want to turn the mouse toggle off, simply hold down the mute button again for two seconds to turn it off. There are a few useful customization settings for this mouse toggle if you wanted to make the mouse pointer bigger, smaller, faster or slower. Head back into the accessibility settings and select the mouse toggle service and choose the configuration option. Make your changes and test it out to see what works best for you. I hope that you found this video helpful and enjoyable to watch. If you did, please consider giving it a big thumbs up and subscribing to my channel for even more awesome tech tips and product reviews. Don't forget that online privacy and security are more important now than ever before and NordVPN is an excellent choice. I use it almost every day to help me unblock internet restrictions when streaming such as this. With NordVPN connected, I can watch the content I enjoy from anywhere. You can easily download and install NordVPN's user-friendly app on all your devices, including Firestick, by searching for it in your app store. With NordVPN, simply connect to any one of their servers to ensure that your online activities are unrestricted and protected from prying eyes and potential cyber threats. The Nord app has some very useful features for your Fire Stick, including threat protection to help keep your device safe from potential security threats by blocking access to malicious websites. Plus, AutoConnect makes connecting to a secure server a breeze by automatically connecting to a network without having to manually do it every time you want to use the internet. Split tunneling lets you choose which apps or websites use the VPN connection and which ones use your regular internet connection. These settings and features are essential for anyone who wants to have a secure and personalised online experience. Check out the links in the video description for the best deals and try it now completely risk-free for 30 days.